Hello card collectors, welcome back to a new video. My name is Pascal and today is August 23rd of 2019. And you all know what that means. It's the big day. The day that the new Pokemon set Hidden Fates is hitting the stores. It's being released in Europe and in the US as well. And we couldn't be more excited. And as you know, due to some very lucky circumstances, we were able to get our hands on a couple of pin collections, Hidden Fates pin collections, three days early. We unboxed them in an earlier video, in two videos actually, one in English, one in German with my friends Sarah and Sandro. And you guys were just amazing. Thank you so much for hanging in with us, for uh, being part of this journey through Hidden Fates. The feedback we got was absolutely stunning. We loved every comment, every like. Thank you so much for all your valuable insight as well. Remember, we've been doing this uh, unboxing, our shop, everything Pokemon related on YouTube for three or four months now. So we're still really fresh. We're learning every day. We're trying to improve and of course, I took all the criticism to heart. Um, I'll try to keep it short and simple, the whole video today. Mm, today's video topic is going to be, uh, we're gonna open some more Hidden Fates uh, pin collections uh, in order to get a total of 36 boosters opened, which would be the equivalent of a regular booster box if Hidden Fates was a regular pack. As you know, you can't buy Hidden Fates product in booster boxes such as this Unified Minds box, but rather in special products which will be released uh, from now, from today on, every two weeks in special packs. For example, um, as we've seen here, I'll show you here in this cam, the pin collection, which marks the beginning. So we've opened uh, four pin collections in the first video, it means four times three boosters, 12 boosters. Then we've opened uh, 12 boosters in the second video, in our German video. And today we're going for the finish. We're doing 12 more boosters from four pin collections. And uh, after that, we'll do a quick recap of what we pulled from all these 36 boosters, because as you might have noticed, the pull rates for this set are through the roof. I can't remember a time when we had so much fun unboxing product because basically every booster pack is almost guaranteed a hit. It's not guaranteed and we'll do that uh, comparison in a later video. But for right now, I couldn't be more excited. Launch day of Hidden Fates. Uh, you're here with us, uh, we're the car collectors, and we'll just dig into four more um, Hidden Fates pin collections. One will be Mewtwo, and the other one will be Mew. And because we've all seen what's inside these, I'll just make it quick and uh, open them off screen, and I'll be right. All right, are you guys still here after the snap? I, le I hope at least half of you, 50%. And um, just a quick re recap, we know what's in these pin collections. I just opened all four of them. We have uh, in each pin collection either a Mew 2 or a Mew pin. Super cute, super beautiful. And I'm sure um, they'll be very popular as collector's items. Then every pin collection also yields us either a Mew promo card, absolutely beautiful, uh, or a Mewtwo promo card. And look at how shiny, not shiny, but look at how hollow it is. Very beautiful. Also the other, that's the other uh, promo card. Also um, for um, code cards for the online TCG, which I will now share with you is number one, number two, number three, and number four. Mm, please make sure to just grab one, leave some for the others as well. And of course, let us know what's, what you got. So besides our uh, promo cards, we also have three booster packs in every um, pin collection, which means now after opening four, we have 12, which brings our total of opened booster packs after this video to 36, as I mentioned. Anything else I need? Yes, I do have some sleeves, my trusted sleeves over here. And I'd say, well, let's just get it cracking. I'll just get my setup started here. And um, yeah, another clear view at all of these boosters, 12 boosters of Hidden Fates 
let's get it going. Number one, uh, and we're starting off with a shiny Charizard booster. And uh, those boosters, by the way, are super well sealed. Code card to the side, and then uh, the card trick, as always, is four from the back. So we will start off with an energy and have one of the rare cards in the back. So, fair type energy. We have a Metapod, a Pokemon Central Lady, a Scyther, a Geodude, Eevee, Jigglypuff, Coughing, Staryu, a Reverse Holo Lapras, and... Oh, wow. That's beautiful. That's almost... Well, it counts as a pull. It is a Holo Zapdos. Good. Let me get my card management uh, here straightened out. We'll have our common and uh, reverse holo cards here on one pile. We'll have the rare cards here, or the holo cards. And are proceeding to a Mewtwo, a shiny Mewtwo booster pack. And if I could just open those boosters, that would be really nice. From the back. Turning around, electric type energy, always very good. So Pokemon Central Lady is here, and I have a Scyther, we have Magmar, we have Jigglypuff, super adorable by the way. We have a Eevee, a Caterpie, a Paris, Ekans, Brock's Pewter City Gym, and oh wow, that's our first GX for today. A Starmy GX, and I absolutely love the colors. That's beautiful, let's get this one sealed. Uh, let's, let's get this one sleeved and uh, we'll put it here and Pikachu will take good care of this until we're through. Pack number three. Starting off with a Scyther, we have Jinx, we have Graveler, Voltorb, Coughing, Ekans, Cubone, Magikarp. A reverse holo energy and Brock's training as oh that's even that's a holo card. That's beautiful. I haven't pulled these yet. So one of the critiques was uh we're not too organized with our cards, so this is what I'm making here. A nice shining pile of cards. Uh, so we'll have them all in one place and not all over the playing mat. Thank you very much uh, for the gentleman who pointed out that we could be a little more thorough with our CMS card management system. Thanks. So uh, here is a uh, fire type energy. Let's see. We have Sabrina's suggestion, Misty's determination, a Metapod, a Jigglypuff, Eevee, Caterpie, Paras, Ekans. Oh wow! And oh my God! Yes, yes, yes. This is one of my favorite Pokemon. And now we've got it as a shiny variant. Garchomp, shiny. I think uh, the the color difference is that it's a little uh, darker. Anyway, a very beautiful card, and I just love how it sparkles. And our rare will be Clefable. So let's get this one sleeved as well. This is our first shiny card pull for today. We're going here to the bench. Hidden Fates booster pack number four, as much as I'm concerned. Ah, I really wish I could make these videos a bit quicker, but then those packs, those packs are so well sealed. A water type energy, Pokemon Center Lady, Sabrina's Suggestion, Scyther, Pikachu, a Voltorb, Coughing, Cubone, Geodude, a reverse holo Jolteon, beautiful, and Blaine's last stand as a rare card. What I'd love to know from you now that uh, Hidden Fates is out in Europe and the US, mm, would you mind commenting your pulls? Because uh, we're really looking forward to see what other trainers, other card collectors pull. This seems to be a not only very popular set, but the, the set is also very good on the full rates, plus the contents are very, very Instagrammable. So we'd love to hear from you what you're pulling. Darkness type energy, a Scyther, Metapod, Magma, Magikarp, Staryu, a Voltorb, uh, Pikachu, our first Pikachu of the day, 
It's just so happy. It knows that it's launch day for Hidden Fates. Jigglypuff. Wow. Oh, yes, 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 yes. This is a beautiful card. This is an absolutely beautiful card. I love Ninetales. I love Alolan Ninetales, even a little more, maybe. I know huge fans of this card. Um, shout out to all our card collector girl colleagues here, Sarah and also Selena, who I know will adore this card. This is a beautiful card. This is also our first um, Fool Art GX. Beautiful, couldn't be happier about this pull. And we're finishing the pack off with Bill's analysis. Uh, just a quick glance. I, I love how the color is a little bit offset from the regular nine tails. It's really nice shiny version. The eyes are very red, but uh, it doesn't bother us. Let's get this one sleeved and it will count towards our pull rates, which is nice. Next up, shall we go? So uh, at the end of this video, I'll give you a quick, uh, just a very, very short recap on, um, on the pulls we've had from video one and video two. Uh, the, the English video that started it all three days ago, then the German follow-up video to share with our Swiss, German, Austrian friends here over in Europe. And uh, then we'll count these uh, the, the, the polls from this uh, opening in as well. And then we'll just know how just how big the yield was of 36 booster packs. So, wow, no, I can't, no, really, two packs? Two shining cards. Oh wow, here's Guzzlord. Here's Guzzlord and I think it even looks better. It looks even better in its shiny form. Uh, regular, it's a rather dark uh, Pokemon, but here in white and red, absolutely stunning. And we're finishing off with our book. All right, so uh, we're going two for two here on these. Not saying no, but um, can't remember when we've pulled Shining GXs in such a quick such a succession. Another Charizard. What are you? What are you bringing us, shiny Charizard? Looks barbaric when I open these boosters, but uh, they're really not easy to crack into. So energy, and then Sabrina, Pokemon Central Lady, Scyther, Slowpoke, Psyduck, Clefairy, a Magikarp, Ekans, a Reverse Hello Graveler, and Butterfree. There you go. Back to Mewtwo. Here we go. Flipping it around. And uh, there's a lot of Metapod. Sabrina suggestion. Okay, let me just get my pile sorted out here. Right. Um, all right. Charmeleon, a Jigglypuff, Caterpie, Paris, Psyduck. Charmander, oh, that's a lovely reverse holo Mew. And then Electrode is our rare card. Okay, just uh, let me just quickly get my cards in order. They're going towards our collection. So we're down to three boosters. We already have some great pulls, but of course I'm hoping to just maybe pull just one more, just one more thing. Like Apple would announce one more thing and I'd love to see what else we can pull from 12 booster packs of Hidden Fates. So, I don't think we've had uh, the Cerulean City Gym, Brock's Paris City Gym, Metapod, Voltorb, Cubone, Geodude, Eevee, a Jigglypuff, a Reverse, Holo Clefairy, and Mr. Mime. And even though he's not, um, he's a rare, but not technically holo, I think this just shimmers so much. Not my favorite Pokemon, but he sure has his good moments. Uh, we all loved him in the Detective, Detective Pikachu movie. Either loved him or hated him. I thought it was funny. So um, second to last pack for our 36 pack total opening is going to be a Shining Mewtwo. And here we have a Unlisted Leaf Energy. Kogas Trap, Ten Surge, Misty, Caterpie, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, a Reverse Clefairy, we've seen that before, and Erika's Hospitality. Beautiful card as well. All right. And then the last pack 
to complete the 36 over the course of three days is going to be a shiny chair wizard. So one last time, we have Misty's Determination, we have Scyther, Sabrina's Suggestion, Staryu, Ekans, Geodude, Cubone, Eevee, a Reverse Jinx, and a Lapras. That's beautiful. All right, all right. So hmm, I'm not quite sure about the pull rates for these 12. Uh, you Just remember, these things are totally random. There's no such thing as a guaranteed hit in Hidden Fates. Um, I would say the rates are slightly higher in general. So let's just quick, quickly see what we've pulled from these 12 booster packs, aside from, of course, the whole rare cards, because we're not counting these towards our um, uh, towards our pulls, but we've started off with a Starmie. We have a Shining Guard Charm, which is beautiful. We have an, and a little Nine Tails GX and a Godlord GX, and this is from 12 booster packs, which means every wave ahead of a big pull, every three booster packs. So this is the yield from these 12. If you remember, I have here um, our pulls from the first video opening and in the first video opening, we did 12 booster packs in our English video. And from these 12 booster packs, we've had one Mewtwo GX, one Zapdos, Moltres, Articuno GX, a Full Art GX. Then we had Pseudo Wudo, we've had uh, Ralts, we've had Kirlia in uh, shiny forms, we've got Charmander, which is the giveaway card from the last video, by the way, and a Hoa GX. I'll just try and quickly um, align them here neatly. So we have those three and, okay, so um, here we have, let me just quickly swap this, put them over here. So what we'll do is uh, we'll count them all together just to get the idea on what we got out of those booster packs. So here is the GX card, then here we'll have the Full Art GX, we'll have the Shining cards, and here the um, Full Art Shiny cards. Good, Shiny GX. Um, then for the German video, and some of you, I'm not sure if you've checked it out already, it's in German, it's not English, but what counts is A, uh, Sarah, Sandra and I had a super great time in front of the camera, so many pulls. And then uh, second one is, I mean, the cards are English, so don't bother too much about the language. Just uh, play your favorite tune if you don't understand a word and either, either learn some German with us or uh, just watch us pull some amazing cards because here comes from our second opening, the German opening, for out of 12 booster packs of Hidden Fates, we've got a Pinsir GX, a Onyx GX, the uh, Moltres Zaptus Articuno GX, We've pulled a Charizard GX and a Mewtwo GX. And these are all cards from the regular set of 68, if you remember that. So there's a regular set of 68, and then there is uh, the Shiny Vault version, which is indicated by SV. And there's 94 there and 68 here for a total of 162 cards in that case, right? I'm counting correctly. Mewtwo GX, all right. And then it got interesting because we also pulled a Ether Foundation Employee, which is a, a full art card. We also pulled Giovanni's Exile. We've also pulled then a Inkei Shiny, a Pseudo Wudo Shiny, a Feromosa Shiny card. And our probably our most popular pull from that video was the Espeon GX in its Shiny variant. So. To continue, today's uh, opening yielded us a Starmie GX, a Garchomp in its shiny var variant, and also an Enolan Ninetales GX, which is a full art GX, and Godlord shiny full art GX. All right, so drum roll now, we're doing the, the count. I have here uh, my trusted notepad, and I'll just note what we get. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven GX cards. Out of 12, out of 36 booster packs, we got all these beautiful GX cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven GX. Continuing on, we also got three, let's say either GX or just regular full art cards. 
So three full art GX and trainer. Good. Moving on, here comes the sauce because, um, of course, why are we buying the set? Because of the shiny cards. They're new, they're originally from GX Ultra Shiny and we want them all. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight Pokemon in their shiny variants. Eight shiny. Place them here because they're so beautiful and then of course these are the crown jewels of the set the four full art gx shiny cards so full art gx shiny so for a total okay so just 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 to quickly give you give you an idea of what we're doing here this is the pile of pulls, not including the, the holo rare cards, just GX and above, of 36 booster packs of Hidden Fates. Now, that's a lot of pulls, and compared to what you'll yield from a regular, um, from a regular booster box with uh, 36 boosters, well, I'd say here you could expect one secret rare card, um, maybe two or three full arts if you're lucky. I think around four GX cards. So I guess they are in seven or eight pulls. What do we get here? Eight and four is 12 and 10 is 22. Okay, so, okay. Out of 36 booster packs of Hidden Fates, we pulled 22 pulls, 22 amazing pulls, which means um, around a 66% chance out of three boosters, you get one of these amazing cards. And don't forget, there is more cards in there. There are um, the, the, the regular Holos are there as well. So um, these are these aren't too shabby either. Plus, um, right now, you always, always, with each pink connect collection, you'll get one of these uh, beautiful promo cards as well. So, is the set worth its money? Most definitely. You can't buy full booster boxes of 36, but you should definitely try and get as many boosters as you can, because as we've seen, so the yield rate is around 66% or 60%, let's say that. Um, you open 10, um, you're pretty guaranteed to get some pulls. <laughs> I'd say a lot. I've never seen a set with that many pulls uh, with such high pull rates. It's an absolute blast. It makes for amazing opening videos, as you've seen and as you should keep seeing. And uh, what uh, one more, one last thing I want to do. Um, these two cards are beautiful, and these are also the first promo cards of a uh, of the new set. So these are the two cards we're going to give away to you guys here uh, out here uh, on YouTube. How are we going to do that? I'm going to take a, a picture of these two uh, beautiful cards. We'll upload them on Instagram. Go find us on Instagram, cardcollectorsch, and then um, just write us a quick comment underneath this picture on what you'd like to see us open next. Do you want to see some more hidden fades? Any other things you'd like to see us open on this channel? And then uh, automatically you're entered for our giveaway. It's it's that easy, nothing to do, just, um, just quick comment, quick like. We really appreciate it. And then we'll send these two cards your way if you're the lucky winner. Good luck. Thank you very much for sticking around. Um, it's always a pleasure doing this with you. I would look forward. I think we'll do some more videos in the next couple of days, probably back in German then because we have some uh, ideas coming up, but um, I'll sure to be back also in English uh, with some new Hidden Fates products once they're out. So as always, thanks for tagging along. It's, it's an amazing journey. I'm happy that you're here and uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you so much.